welcome to Chef Jane. Today, I thought, why don't we make a dish that y'all are probably familiar with? It's called dokoki. Now, for those of you who are probably wondering, hmm, what is dokoki? That's okay. Let me explain it to y'all. So, dokoki is a very, very popular dish here in Korea. It's normally like a comfort food, street food, and it's also very, very easy to make. So originally, it was made with spicy sauce. So in English, tteokbokki is called spicy rice cake. But eventually, it evolved into people making this with cream sauce. But today, I thought, why don't we go in between and make rosé tteokbokki or rosé sauce tteokbokki. So I hope you enjoy this video and also try it out yourselves after watching this video. But without further ado, let's go right into me introducing all the ingredients. So shall we start? Let's go! Alright, so out here with me, I have some olive oil, chicken stock, gochujang, and 300 milliliters of milk and 200 milliliters of fresh cream some onions, well this is half an onion, and one packet of bacon, um, enoki mushroom, and 300 grams of dok, of rice cake, one tablespoon of minced garlic, and some... What is this? So this is a question that I really, really wanted to ask everyone. I originally called it green onion, but everyone's correcting me and saying it's leek. Could you all just leave a comment and let me know what this is exactly called? Alright, anyway, let's go right into chopping up our ingredients. So with the bacon, what we're going to do is just chop it up like that. Very, very easy. There we go, we have all the bacon chopped and putting that on the side. And onion, doesn't have to be thin. And we're done. Easy! Alright, so let's start. We are going to get olive oil, put it in the wok. And then spread it, spread it, and you add your minced garlic. And let's add the onions and the bacon. I like the sound. All right, so just uh, leave it cooking for a bit, and then you're going to then add all the liquid. So you don't have to get all this fully cooked because it is going to continuously get cooking when you add the milk and fresh cream. So, let's just add all the liquid now. Fresh cream! Some milk! going to wait until it's boiling a little. I think it's uh, slowly starting to boil, I hope. Shall we sing? What's your favorite song, guys? What's your favorite song? Justin Bieber? Little Mix? I like Little Mix. 
Zara Larson. I like Zara Larson. Dua Lipa, Rita Ora. All right, sorry. Now I'm just calling out all the female artists. Respect. So when someone puts me on the spot and they go, Jane, why don't you sing us all a song? Seriously, that's like the most awkward question or like put me in an awkward position and I'm like, what song? I, can't, I just can't think of a song like on the top of my mind. So I always end up singing this song. I don't know if you know this. Somewhere wrong for the rainbow. And what's after that? Blue birds fly. Lit? I don't know. But yeah. I love music. I just suck at remembering lyrics. All right, let's just go on to our next step. We're gonna add the thought. Make sure you don't like pour it like that, or else you are gonna hurt yourself. Little by little, little by little. All right, now that it's been simmering for a bit, we are going to add one tablespoon of gachi jam. And then you mix. Ooh, I like the color. So, um, for those of you who cannot find rice cake, the thok, you can actually just uh, use pasta. I've actually tried that too, and it was so lush. But anyway, we're doing the dog today, so let's stick with the dog. Okay, so after you mix it a little, you can now add some chicken stock. Oh, I'm really loving the color. Mm -mm 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 -mm. the chicken stuff. Now I'm going to say add two to three tablespoons. I'm gonna say two tablespoons. But three is fine. But two. Let's do two. And then And then once that's in, put your enoki mushroom. Alright, so, uh, let me just kind of tear it up a little. You can use other mushrooms, it doesn't necessarily have to be enoki. Use whatever you can find, but mushrooms. So now, okay, so it was somewhere above for the rainbow, way up high. Why then, oh, why can't I? Yeah, I really suck. I give up. I do like to sing. I just suck at memorizing. Yay! Alright, let's mix. Get that. To the bottom, bottom, bottom! Let's see if I remember my song. I don't know the English part. Don't you never ever let me go. Never ever let me go. Never ever let me. Never ever let me go. Yeah, of course I know that. It's so easy. I just don't know all the rest of the parts. 
feel so ashamed. All right, so we are going to add, add the last ingredient, which is leek. Green onion! Woo. Woo. And we are done. Let's just have that chill for a bit. Mix it, mix, mix, mix. Mix it, mix, mix, mix. Oh, I can't wait to try this. And we are done. It's time for Chef Jane to try this lovely, delicious, oh, scrumptious dish. All right, let's try it out. We have our rosé sauce rice cake. Rosé sauce tteokbokki. Let's try it. So it smells so good. I like the color. I keep saying this. I really like the color. And actually the enoki mushroom kind of looks like it's ramen. Ramen. But, all right. I'll, I'll, I'll just try it now. better than the spicy sauce and the cream sauce obviously because it, it's, it's in the middle mm. I actually like this only because it's not too creamy there's a little bit of kick in it but it's not so bad because I'm really bad with spicy food from time to time and on all my conditions like on that day but I think I can have this all day all day but so you all know how to make the rosé sauce rice cake, the rosé sauce or rojé tteokbokki. So try it out and let me know what you think. And also please, please, please don't forget to press like, leave a comment and definitely let me know if it's leek or green onion. And please press that follow button if you're not following Chef G. All right, so that's it for now, and I'll see you again with something better, something greater. But for now, bye.